A 16-year-old accused of driving drunk, crashing, and killing his 16-year-old friend is now facing serious charges. The crash happened in Kannapolis the day before Thanksgiving. Our Tina Terry learned those teens might have been drinking at a party before all this happened. And Tina, you learned that ALE agents want to know if any adults should be charged as well. Uh, yes, Erica, they want to know if an adult served 16 years it's pretty shocking that the someone young would die over something like drunk driving. 13 year old Giovanni Gonzalez says that deadly crash right up the street from his house should be a wake up call to all teenagers. I can't believe that in just a few moments, everything can just go away. Your future can go away. Police say 16 year old Damari Crowder was driving a stolen car with no license the night of the crash. His friend was in the passenger seat and alcohol law enforcement officials say Crowder may have been drinking alcohol at a party before the crash. We have some indications that there could have been a party involved, but we don't know if it was at an ABC licensed business, or if it was a house party or some other underground type of party that uh, we're still trying to determine if it's true or not. Kannapolis police believe the teen was intoxicated and speeding when he hit a curb and went airborne over Dale Earnhardt Boulevard. The car flew nearly 200 feet and crashed into this tree, killing 16 year old passenger Antonio Meadows. ALE agents are now investigating to find out if an adult provided alcohol for Crowder, which would be a crime. Crowder, now out of the hospital, is facing a host of charges, including felony death by vehicle, DWI, and reckless driving. Mm. That was our Tina Terry reporting. The Concord police have cited Crowder for reckless driving and several other traffic violations. That happened just a few weeks ago in November. He was cited back then in another incident. In this case, he has been charged as an adult and will appear in court tomorrow.